finished our artichoke dip for today. And I made this channel so you guys can know how to cook and bake. So let's hop right into it. You're going to take one block of cream cheese, put it in your crock pot, one cup of mozzarella, you're gonna take one can of artichokes, one half a cup of sour cream, some parm. You're going to take onion powder. Oh no. I forgot to add spinach. It's like balls of grass. Oh, I already did. You're going to take garlic powder now. And then you're going to put, this is optional. And you're just going to put that much. I didn't even take off the cap. Okay. Now you're going to put it on to high. And then you're going to occasionally mix it until it's nice and creamy. Okay, guys, we're back. we're back and we have our thing. Actually, now it checks out. And it is ready. <laughs> um, we stirred it occasionally and we let it sit for about an hour and a half. Mm. About an hour. And now we're gonna try it. Mm. Make sure you like and subscribe. If I don't like this. Delicious. Who day? Guys, our next snack is Brookies with, with peanut butter cups. Now you're gonna take this. Oh, I made this channel so you guys can know how to cook and bake. You're gonna take your cookie dough and then you're gonna smash all of them. And then you're just gonna smash them into a pan. What's on your pan? Grease. Make sure you grease it with Pam or any cooking spray. Other side, make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below if you like bangles or rams. You can use any type of cookie batter, but pre-made cookie batter is probably the best. Now you're gonna take your peanut butter cups and you're just gonna pop one inside. Preheat our oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And now you're gonna take your brownie mixture, pre-made already before the video. Link in the description. And you're just gonna pour it. Hope it and hope it comes out. How much? One fourth a cup. Now we're gonna put them in for 15 minutes. I do not want to get burnt for, for like the millionth time. taste it but this took about 20 minutes in the oven and then we took it out and we let it cool for 10 minutes let's try it delicious now for 
for our next deck, we are making some Swedish meatballs. Hooray! First, you put in your meatballs, put them in the microwave to thaw them out. Like two, three minutes. Take one cup of brown sugar. One spoonful of garlic. You put the lid on and let it sit. Who did? On a crock pot on high, they cooked for about on, uh, an hour on high. Um. Good. <laughs> Delicious. Who 